Prince Harry is facing a key predicament, and he will run out of time to make up with his father after being accused of throwing truth bombs at the royal family, claims a royal expert. The Duke of Sussex, now in California, has been criticized for criticizing his family since stepping down as a senior working royal in 2020. According to royal expert Emily Andrews, Harry is seeking redemption for his family in the UK. Speaking to woman about the Duke, Ms Andrews said, speaking to sources close to Harry, it's clear that, his successful monetization of it aside, he's tired of playing a bit part in a narrative of family conflict and would like nothing more than to recover his reputation and become known, in time, as a serious player in the philanthropic world. Yet there's a theory doing the royal rounds, that Harry threw his truth bombs and vented his spleen to Oprah and Netflix, and, most poisonously of all, in his book, Spare, on the premise that he would have a long time to make up with his dad. Speaking of Harry's supposed intention to reconcile with his father, she added that Charlotte's ongoing cancer treatment may have changed that potential time frame, and for Harry, there can be no meaningful rehabilitation. Also speaking on the Duke of Sussex, an insider claimed that Harry thought that he might have 20 years with his father to mend broken bridges before the king's diagnosis. As for his fractured relations with his brother, Prince William, Harry previously detailed a physical fight that the pair had back in London in 2019. In his bombshell memoir Spare, Harry writes that William knocked him to the floor and ripped his necklace after heated words about his wife, Meghan Markle. Harry, who is now a father of two, also shared how he and William had begged their father not to marry the now Queen Camilla, whom he referred to as a wicked stepmother. Also speaking of his father, Harry claimed that following the death of their late mother in 1997 when he was just 12 the now king didn't hug him after hearing of her tragic death. Harry and Meghan now live in a multi-million pound mansion in Montecito with their two children, Archie, 5, and Lilibet, 3.